hey, hope everyone's doing great today. Uh, we are back to more Stardew Valley. And uh, we're going to do more um, just building out our farm. But um, I mean, since we're... Oh, okay, cutscene. I guess we're doing cutscene first. It looks like I'm just enjoying the waves. Yeah, I suppose I could be pondering big questions, but... Uh, I mean, I suppose I could be doing that too. Looking for fish? I don't know about that. That doesn't look like I'm looking for fish. I'm just kind of standing there. I'm just going to say... Just enjoying the waves. Nope. That was apparently the wrong thing. Sorry, Leo. Uh, well, I don't want to say this, because that's not very interesting. <laughs> What's the place like where you're from? Oh, basically the same. That, that feels anticlimactic. Um, and there's a farm right here, so I don't think that matters too much either. Um, there's forests and beaches and mountains here too, so I'm going to say a town's full of people. You don't know what people are. I just depressed Leo. What does that matter to a bird? I have, I'm going to say yes. Fort Leo. Whoa, kind of creepy, Willy. All right, so uh, anyway, as I was saying, since we're already on Ginger Island, we'll uh, do some stuff here, and uh, then we'll head back to the mainland towards the end of the end game day. Hey, Adam Gems. You just uh, missed me ruining a kid's life. Not my proudest moment. Bowls here. So we'll grab this. Oh, coconut. Take the coconut. Alright, run, tiger slab. Run! Well, it doesn't matter. I won't kill you anyway. I'm feeling good. How are you doing today, Adam Jumps? Super soothing. I still need six more walnuts to get that. Oh, right, but I want the teleport thing. Just like 20. Alright, I want to take the golden coconuts since we're going to the mainland. We'll crack those open. Um, mm, I kind of want to. Hmm. These are year round on Ginger Island. But I kind of want these also in my greenhouse, but. I don't 
on them. Because these just say plant in warm weather, and I bet you that even during winter, these will still grow here. So, I think what I could probably do is have an orchard on the right side, pineapples on this side, and then fill out the rest with um, the terra tuber. Ter yeah. I'll just keep this here for the time being. Alright, uh, ginger, coconut, mussel, coral. And, you know, I don't need all this ore here. We're actually going to take this stuff back uh, island side. Prismatic shard I don't need to keep here either. Really a lot of this stuff I don't need to keep here. Triple shot espresso. Oh, although... I should go do my island rounds first. A little sad because game life by you is delayed and they gave you money. Oh, they refunded your purchase? Yeah, they have refunded your purchase. That's not a good sign. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess it's... On the other hand, it's good that you're not just out money and not getting what you paid for when you wanted it, but it also sucks because it kind of looks like they're just not going to make it at this point. Hidden try. Okay, I already know about this. I just don't have the gems. If I should just like grab random gems and put on that shrine just to see if I can get it. Alright, is there anything that I especially need to get from here? Um, I mean, this is not a bad thing to use regular coconuts for. Get some cool stuff from them. I do need that banana sapling, but I don't know that I have five dragon teeth. Those are just muscle, regular muscles. Interesting. I mean, it's not bad stuff. I just also don't feel like a sense of emergency to go get them either. Snake skull. I already have that though. Fossil. Already got that. I don't, don't need that. Is there not another new survey thing? I guess not. I guess we're we're all done with those. If that's how I get the other thing. It was from fishing. Well, I was already fishing over here. I guess I'll try again, but. Pan as well.
I mean, I won't be upset about getting more blue discus. Or tilapia, I guess. And more tilapia? Okay, this one's acting differently, so I don't think it's tilapia. Okay, yeah, no, that's blue discus. Uh, worst part is I was really hoping to be one of the first 1,000 people who buy game to be invited to Dev's Discord. Um, well, yeah. I imagine that they're probably going to do something different for that. They should, anyway. Oh, okay, there we go. We got a bone. All right. That, that goes there. Sweet. Heck yeah, what you got for me? Collect rewards. Ooh, walnuts! And a banana sapling. Perfect. Alright, uh, give me another hint. Snake spines might be found in the western region of the island. Okay. Um... Catch the scrout. Uh, they can cancel the whole game? I mean, they could, I suppose. I mean, hopefully they're not going to, but it would be a waste of everyone's time if they did, but I can see if it doesn't look good that uh, they may just end up doing that. Oh, I'm, at, I'm out of Ultra Balls. I never bought any additional ones. You scoot over to Twitch. Pull this up. Dang, only have enough to buy one ball. All right. I can spell, right? There we go. All right. Well, I wonder where the heck it would be on the west side of the island. Maybe I need to fish over there, too? That seems... not right. Cause, I mean, I've been digging everywhere over there. Oh, hey, people. Hi, hey, Jody. Oh, that's right, they only have one dialogue here. Hey, kid. You look the same. Okay, right, I'll talk to the rest of them later. Put you there. Um, but yeah, I don't know if I have to fish here or if it's the um, uh, like the panning that needs done. Because yeah, I've been digging everywhere over here. Unless it's under like an artifact spot, and I just got to be patient. But we'll try catching a few things, I suppose. See if he'll come up with fishing. But, it, I don't know, because it's weird. He gave, like, a very clear hint that there was fish before. So I feel like it wouldn't be fishing again.
Oh, that was lame. What editing program are you using? What, for like my video? Or there's a lot of different kinds of editing I do. Where's the panning at? Did it disappear on me? Yeah, it disappeared on me. It looked like it was like right here. Um. Well, I used to use Adobe Premiere, um, but I don't have access to Premiere anymore. Um, and I, I can't afford <laughs> to, to use Adobe products right now. Um, and then I started using Blender, um, which is a 3D modeling program, but it has a video editor in it. Um, but it can be difficult to use sometimes, <laughs> to say the least. Um, oh, I do have a... Well, I just got any sapling though, so I don't need that. Um, so now I use a program called Shotcut, and it seems to do almost everything that I need to do um, pretty simply, with the exception of a few special effects. It's it, sometimes the keyframing is a little buggy. Like I do not advise using Shotcut for keyframing, um, but otherwise it's all right and it's free. So, let's see, I don't need the snake skull. I'll put that in there. Um, I'll keep the flute blocks here. And bone fragments. And the ginger. Yeah, I suppose that's it. Yeah, I don't know where the other skeleton piece is. It's probably an artifact spot that I have to dig. What's up, Sam? The jazzy tune. Hey, Kent. What's up? Oh, he says something different. Before he stepped on a crab. Oh, they, he said something different too. Does Jody say something different? Nope. I guess if they're in a different spot then they say something different I don't know uh, it's already five but I could, um, could go get the um, the skeleton quest thing done uh, short Shotcut can have a few audio layers. Yeah, um, I don't know if there's a max. I haven't hit a max if there is one. Uh, but yeah, you can have multiple video layers and um, multiple audio layers. I don't need that. Hi, Granny. What's up, Elliot? You live on a beach, dude. You're gonna be full of sand all the time. Oh, Penny. You know, there are a lot of redheads on this island. Like, you got Robin and... Um, Leah is like, you know, the orange hair, ginger kind of um, redhead. And then Penny's got a redhead thing going on. Um, and then obviously you got Sandy here with like the almost like purplish hair. Um, I guess Marty's is brown. I thought Marty's had kind of like a reddish tint to it, but I guess not. But Vincent's got like red hair. I don't know. Kent's got blonde, so I guess blonde and brown, yeah, that makes sense for him. But yeah, it just seems statistically unlikely for so many people here to have red hair. It's cool though. I like red hair.
Oh, I got lucky with that ladder. Oh, he's so bad at attacking things downwards. Oh, that's my hoe, not my pickaxe. Whoa! Prismatic shard from a frickin' dust sprite! Heck yeah! That was an unexpected prismatic shard. Uh, you're angry at Sony Vegas because your recording is in MKV and, and Sony doesn't see. Uh, yeah, that's weird. Um, I know Shotcut works with MKVs because um, I used to record in a... Uh, it was an MP4 codec, but it was one that uh, I guess was just not a very popular version of that codec. Um, so it will actually like automatically convert um, my files that just doesn't agree with it very well. And um, it converts it to MKVs, so I know at least Shotcut does. Um, but I usually um, output and even edit in uh, MP4s um, with like the highest quality that I can get because uh, it's still a hell of a lot smaller file while still um, maintaining a lot of quality. Okay, there are way too many of these things. It's kind of cool. Let's get rid of the Jojo Cola. It's 270. I don't know if I have a Dark Sword yet, though, so I'm going to hold on to it. I'm about to say, where did that dust sprite go? What happened? Definitely gonna have to hit up Clint with all those geodes. Version of DaVinci, you can't add pics. Yeah, I, with Shotcut, you can add in pictures because I just have a picture of like a, a black square um, because just a simple color screen isn't one of their default uh, filters. So, um, or not filters, uh, effects. So, I have um, just a, a plain black picture that I use for some stuff. Um, if I need to fade to black for something um, or cover up something that does not need to be publicly viewable, then I'll do that. Okay, how are we doing on this? Seven more. Six more. Five more. I think I'm going to run out of time. Just want to add photos of Barbie merch. Yeah, that's really easy to do in Shotcut. Yeah, 
yeah, you just open file and then uh, add it to your playlist of files and then just drag it down into the timeline or, you know, video track. And uh, if you need it in another layer, like, you know, you just right click and um, go to track operations and um, add a new track. <sighs> yep, didn't make it. Yeah, it definitely has its limitations. Like there, like I said, it with the uh, with keyframing, it is uh, not great. <laughs> so, um, yeah, there's some things that it just doesn't do well. Get rid of this bait. Weather reports like sunny and sunny. Hello, wife. Oh, yay, water my crops. Oh. More and more dialogue. Alright, do we have anything we can sell? I guess the diamond? I need to do something with my inventory. <laughs> That's step one here. Um, we can complete that by doing something with all these melons. No, don't eat. Stop eating the melon. work to render NPV to ABI and later edit and something. Yeah, and ABI, I mean, it's... ABIs are good quality, but my god, they're, those file sizes are huge. Like, typically, you only want ABI to work with, like, raw footage. Um, you usually would convert it before you edit it. Uh, or, I mean, you could edit it with ABI and, and like, output to a different format, but... Okay, those are some receipts. Put my new shiny prismatic shard in there. Uh, fish. Fishy fishes. Oh, I didn't grab a pineapple again. <laughs> Driving me crazy. Alright, blue disses, lapia, lionfish. Um, so we'll put the sweet pea in there. I don't have any other kind of forage thing. That's a lot of coal. I, mean, I guess I'll put these in here for the time being. Um, geodes. Put that in there. Some rocks and fiber, hardwood, regular wood, wild seeds, and um, I'll throw the mahogany seeds in there too. Um, but Actually, I need to crack open these geodes. I want to leave this stuff. Um, that's so many diamonds. I need to actually get my other crystallarium set up.
The recording is in a few parts, so it's even more work. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of work. Parsnips ready. Parsnippities. Amongst a lot of other things. And we'll go ahead and harvest all these. Of stuff. But, I mean, I haven't been over here in a while, so it makes sense. Alright, my inventory's full. You ever made homemade ice cream? Uh, it's been... Well, so I, like, personally have not. As a family, um, we've made it before, but, like, my like my mother made it. Um, it's interesting that you brought that up, though, because my mother was just talking about it. Um, and apparently, she's apparently planning on fixing some, so very interesting timing there. Um, but yeah, it, it's, regardless, it's been ages since I've done anything with homemade ice cream. Have you ever made homemade ice cream? ancient seeds from this before actually like unlocking the ancient seed. I think it's safe to say that Clint's been open now <laughs> since it's basically noon. No, only your aunt. Yeah, I think that's it. The rest of them are all fruits. We did have a dark sword. Oh well, we got another dark sword now. Okay, ancient seeds and cacti and mix seeds. Um, oh, you know what? I need to plant more parsnips though, but we'll put these strawberry seeds in. Summer, we got tomato and corn and blueberries, eggplants. Yeah, let's go ahead and put these fruits in here. We gotta hurry to get the plants, we've got like three hours left. 
time that goes by so fast in this game. Goodness. I need to get um, a pineapple plant in here. I'll deal with that stuff later. We gotta get going. Oh my goodness, okay. It's fine because I need to go up this way anyway. I totally was going to forget and go the long way, so I guess it's a good thing we got distracted. Son of a, he's not even here. Must be on Ginger Island. Well, fudge. Um, I guess we'll finish off this quest then. Yeah, there's three of them right here. Now, how come he can throw his bones over this, but I can't hit him? There we go. Boom. Done. Today you're watching Cage Ice Cream Recipes and was wondering which is best, but you're scared you'll waste ingredients. Well, it's not a waste if you learn something from it. That's, that's how I always look at it. I wonder what would happen if I... I don't think I can pick it up as long as something's in it. I don't really know the best place to put that thing. These things are done. Not a whole lot of room to put anything in there, though, that's for sure. Tiger Slimes, we got a new one. Can I build another one of the incubators? Yeah. Two iridium bars and a hundred slime. But you know what else I could probably do? Is go in here. And get all these slimes. And 
and then just... No, I guess I can't take it out. Never mind. I was going to say just take that one out, but... Nope, can't do that. Cacti, that's, that's it, rest are fall and summer. Alright, um, I didn't even realize I got that, the bone sword. Throw these in there. And now let's check out our uh, crystallariums. Throw in our brewables. Okay, yeah. A lot of cool stuff here. Um, got. Was it the Lunarite? Mudstone. Okay, now I can actually do what I'm supposed to do here and place these things. <laughs> Oh, no, I can't put it diagonally like that. Uh, today you saw weird D&D free dice. Die. Could, this could be a scam? Uh, I mean, I don't know. It could be like a promotion for something, um, but... I don't typically trust anything that's free, um, but I would have to kind of look at it and see if my scam radar goes off, you know. Yeah, you can send the link. But yeah, as a general rule of thumb, I am very wary of anything that's free. Alright. Um, I don't know where my horse is at. Oh, there's horse. Mirror horse. We're gonna sell off these gems. Well, let's go down here. Check out our fish ponds. I know I still don't have your pineapples. You're allowed to hate me. Man, scarecrows are getting this stuff. Yeah, I guess I forgot to put the scarecrows down. Crap.
Oh, let's, um... Let's see, I already replanted everything in here, right? Yeah. Okay, we're good there. Now I've got nothing I can do in there. Um... Take void. Um, two, three, two, three, one. Oh, and put the slime in there. Really need to make more stuff for in here, but. We can work on that later. Um, ah, yes, all these things have come to fruition. Uh, do I think Baldur Gate 3 will be for mouse like RuneScape? Uh, I am not overly familiar with Baldur. I have Baldur 2, but I haven't played it because I haven't played Baldur 1. Um, I, I just, I don't know anything about the game, really. Um, so I don't know how they've played traditionally. Uh, but if they're typically mouse-dominant, then I would imagine it would stay the same. Like, I'm trying to think, the only thing I really use keyboard for while playing RuneScape is... Sometimes I'll use the arrow keys to move the camera, but that's about it. And it's like, I think you can just use the, um, the scroll wheel button to move the camera in RedScape. If I remember correctly, I could be completely wrong on that. But I feel like the arrow keys is not the only way to move. The camera. Uh, do we have enough to do these? Probably the rainbow trout. I can't remember how many of those things I have though. I guess I'll just keep collecting these because I'm not too sure. Oh wait, actually I do know 48. Um, and we do not have 48 of any of those. I could throw a combination of them in though, but even that, it's what, 27, 30, um, yeah, 27, 37, so then 42, um, 50, there's just 54, okay. Yeah, actually that is. I'll grab that then. We're gonna make some aged row. Assuming I did math right. Nope, don't need it. All right, and then a star fruit. Be so glad when this is done and I can do the water retaining. All right, well, tomorrow we're going to try Clint again. Um, tomorrow in game and then uh we'll head up to robins and move our slime hutches and i think we'll go ahead and commission another uh fish pond to be built
This is just such a nuisance to constantly have to do. I'm so glad that the 100% water retaining soil has been added to the game. Let's see here, has our dinosaur hatched yet? Nope, not yet. It's still cooking. Alright, well, I'm, I'm going to open up the doors and we're going to see if tomorrow they'll, um, they'll be able to handle that. Or, or I guess vice versa, if the grass will be able to handle them. fruits. I mean, we could wait till tomorrow, but I feel like we're going to have our hands full tomorrow. Got the apricot, peach, I think the rest were all forageable. Plums and blackberries, and then salmon berries. And I didn't use all these eggs, so I can place two of those back. Alright, um... Got exactly two hours. Wonder if I can make a quick trip to the mines. I wish I could see my horse. Winner of today, Quasi? Uh, I can check Discord real quick. Um, here we go. No announcement. So, usually there's no announcement. That means he's going to be on. So, he should be on. Uh, four. Let's see here. Um, do, 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 do. what do we want to make? I mean, we, we need a lot more copper and iron for sure. Um, but I also need the furnaces, so we're going to take the copper, the coal, and the iron. And we're also going to take what pathetic amounts of stone that I have still ended up having enough <laughs> for the amount of copper that I had. Alright. We'll, we'll put the copper back. We'll bring the extra three furnaces. Really wish I had my horse. I don't know where horse is at. But I think I'll have enough time. I don't think we'll pass out. And even so, I mean, you know, what? A thousand gold is the penalty? Well, I can pass out 145 times then. We're good. I mean, there's also the energy penalty, but I mean, you know, I can just eat food if I really need it. We didn't start fire, except we totally did, because this is our furnace room. Quarry? Oh, been here in a while. Ooh, we need these resins. Yeah, I'm just going to pass out. There's too much good stuff here that I can, if I can see. <laughs> like, I know the point of the quarry is that there's, like, rocks and stuff that spawn here, but... I kind of like it as, like, a dedicated orchard space, too.
Yeah, see, so yeah, I pass out another 19 times with today's riches. Oh, I just pickaxed the bed. Alright, let's see here. Clint, we're gonna call you at 6 o'clock in the morning. This is how it is at 9 a.m. Two of because Yeah, I already have everything. Uh, Robin. Also 9 a.m. Let's see your fish pond. A lot of stone. We'll have to buy it directly from her. But it's five of seaweed and green. Alright, weather report. Sunny here, sunny there. Fortune teller. Super luck! Yeah! Maybe I should uh, dungeon delve tomorrow, or today rather. Weird time to call, <laughs> yeah. Take this blueprint. Geode Crusher! Oh my god, I'd never have to see Clint again? Where'd that Geode Crusher be? Diamond, two gold bars, 50 stone. Oh, and Kent's sent me a bomb in the mail. Thanks. Do, 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 do. I'm on my way to build a fantastic machine so I never have to see Clint's face again. See your uh, stone and diamond. Okay. You know what, let's, let's grab four of these. Um, oh boy, I probably do not have any soul though. Or at least not that many. Oh my god, I need 50. Alright, I'll have to wait till Robin's open. Alright, um... Oh, let me close that before they all get out. Dinosaur yet? Nope, that dinosaur taking a long time. Sweet! Warp totem. Uh, oh, I totally forgot to sell that stuff. How did you dig up a truffle outside of the fence? It's a little sus. Sell that salmon jetty. I wonder if an egg's already hatched. No, it's still cooking. Alright. Just had to check. Oh, I saw that cloud. I'm like, why is some of this wet and other parts aren't? But no, it's it's all watered. lot of stuff in my inventory but it's going to be time to see Robin here so I'm gonna go ahead and travel upwards some pine tar pine tar is like the thing I really need the least Like, actually, hold on. I'm, I'm going to take a little trip over to the Stardew Valley Wiki. Because I feel like I never use Pine Tar in anything. So, let's take a look over here. Look up Pine Tar. Um, recipes. Okay, it is used for speed grow fertilizer. But 
we don't use speed grow fertilizer anymore because now we have deluxe speed grow fertilizer. Uh, it's used in looms. Well, okay, I can make a few more looms, but after the next nine looms that I make, I don't need to make looms anymore. Okay, it is used for rain totems. That's new. I didn't know rain totem was even a thing. So that's actually pretty helpful for some stuff, especially on Ginger Island. Heck, I needed those. Okay. Um, but yeah, before rain totem, <laughs> it was just loom and speed grow, which was pretty pointless. So I'm actually kind of glad that rain totems require them now because otherwise it's like, what's even the point? See a rain totem. When did these come out? 1.4. No, 1.4 can be used in tailoring. So I guess it came out before 1.4. I guess rain totems aren't new, but this is the first time I've actually have seen a rain totem. Huh. Alright, well, interesting. Alright, back to the game. Well, I guess I'm glad I have all these pine tars now. <laughs> rain totems. But I guess even that's still pretty kind of like, you know, how long are you going to need to make rain totems for? Because rain totems are helpful for getting fish, which is primarily only good when you need to get them for either a fish pond or the community bundle. But I've already completed the community bundles, so I don't need specific fish for that. And I, uh, I, I mean, I pretty much, I don't think any of the ones that I need for fish ponds are rain exclusive, so I don't really need that either. Um, I've got sprinklers, so I don't need rain for um, watering, keeping crops watered. So it's really just Ginger Island because those gem birds only come out at night. All right, not at night, only come out when it rains. Alright, move buildings. So you're, I think... Let me look at my map that I drew. What did I do with that map? Here it is. Alright, um... So here, can it go? I can go on those stones. Okay, because I want to at least have that there for a pathway, but then I would also kind of like a... Maybe I might want a chest here, too. There, let's see. We'll move that one there. Why is this not working? There we go. I like how the butterfly's frozen in place. But this isn't. <laughs> Alright, so I have all this... You know what, we can... We can put it here. Alright, so those have successfully been moved, which means that now, for my fish ponds... Oh, but all that's grass. Crap! Okay. I'll be back, Robin. Run, 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 I guess in this case it's Gallop. Oh, I have to go this way with my horse, though. That sucks. I wish there was, like, room for... You know what? I could move this a little bit closer to my house. I won't be able to go up this way, but I could get through here with my horse. I might actually go and move that. Alright, I don't need to scythe all of this out. Um, 
<laughs> I didn't even bring the ingredients I need for the fish pod. Wow, I am stupid. Okay. <laughs> Let's head back up here. Uh, nope, not that kind. One, two, three, four, five. And, oh my god, I don't have enough seaweed. Oh, hydrate. Okay. Down some water real quick. Thank you for that, Hydrate. Um, oh, I totally missed your message. It said better than midnight. Yeah, I don't know. I think I'd rather get a call at midnight than 6 a.m. Because if I get a call at 6 a.m. and I was asleep, then that means I'm just up for the rest of the day. But if I get a call at midnight, I can go back to sleep. It's still dark. I can sleep for, you know, another six hours at least. Not longer. Um, I would I would rather get a call at midnight, but I do not like that uh, I got no seaweed. So we're gonna grab the, the seaweed anyway. You throw these things in here. Uh, geode crusher. And our four here. You know what, the Geo Crusher I actually will keep in here. And then I've got to go collect... Um... Oh, Quasi began? Awesome. We'll raid out as soon as this day's done with. But i got to go get some seaweed now. Really, 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 really hoping that there's some seaweed that I can just forage on the beach and not have to sit there and fish for. There's urchins. Some coral. There is no seaweed on the beach. Guess we go and fish. Hopefully, I can get it before Robin closes. Uh, we going to Oh my God! What in the hell? Oh, that's probably that super cucumber. And looks like we hooked it again. Look, I, I don't have the bobber for this. I just want some seaweed. S stop hooking this thing. Just give me seaweed. There we go. Got it. Here's my horse. I'm in a very singing mood this stream. girl. I would like a fish pond. Alright, I want to keep it on the same line. So, it's right here. Okay, so it's just right here. Nice. Eh. Well, 
come over here. I still have all of this coal and iron in my inventory. Collect these things. And then, uh, let's get some more iron ingots made. Used up pretty much all of that coal. Oh, I missed a couple. There we go. I hate to have left my horse up in the mountains. I reckon it'll be all right. All right, that incubator's still running. Thunder egg. So I'll put that in there. Um, need more crystallariums. What do I need for those? Uh, gold bars, radium bars, and battery packs. And stone! Oh, I've only got one gold bar. And how many did it take, two? Oh, five. Okay, can't make any crystallariums right now. I hate this, but I do have to go to Clint again. Because I need to buy some ores. Oh, goodness. Almost karaoke today stream. <laughs> Yeah, I don't I don't know why I'm so singing today. That's it's, it's not me. Uh Okay. I think we can make it possibly Clint, it's going to be close. It's going to be so close. I messed up by not bringing my horse back. No, we're not going to make it. Oh, we made it. <laughs> Let's just we're gonna spend all of our money on coal. Okay. That's just what we're gonna do. So we're gonna process these. Because I don't know if you can throw these in a cheated pressure, so I I, I don't wanna wait. We're gonna go ahead and crack them open. Alright, now... <laughs> uh, I need stone. And copper ore. I bought coal, not copper. So... Ooh, that was dumb there. Okay. Let's get these things thrown in here. Okay. 
That's a lot of coal. Do we already have... Yeah, we already have the pyrite in there. We can take those out as well. Um, I'll leave the amethyst since it seems like there's a use for them. But we can sell that other stuff. Alright, uh, maple syrup, oak resin, and pine tar. Turn our mahogany seed there. Grapes, sweet peas, and then um, just got the stone, the bomb, and warp totem to build something with. Throw the warp totem in there. Where's the, uh, the catalog thing at? Oh, it's right here in my freaking face. Ow, okay. Um, can't leave yet. Got bomb, and then what was the other thing? Oh, we also got the tarot tubers, but um, the stones. All right, stones and tarot tubers. Really need to have another shipping bin somewhere over there. I guess I need to put the saplings in that chest too. Wait until I can uh, get back to Ginger Island. Yeah, we'll throw those in there too. And yeah, I'll just I'll hold on to the slime egg. Alright, uh greenhouse. There's not much going on here. We'll leave the fruit on the tree. All right, we can slap our honey in there, but that's about it for that. You know what? I guess I do need to grab four of those end table things. use signs and it's it's actually probably better than use signs because then it doesn't consume the item um because that, that's an actual item sitting there whereas the signs it just kind of like imprints the picture um but i feel like these look better and i don't usually make a whole lot of aesthetic decisions when it comes to games um i do my aesthetic stuff elsewhere um but I uh, I really think that those look better. Fill those up. Uh, I grabbed wrong things. <laughs> For some reason, I got twice as many eggs. Throw those things back. And you know what? While I'm here, I'll go ahead and slap that amethyst in, too. And preserve jars doing their thing. Let's come down here to starfruit. Oh, they're harvestable! Yes! Uh, 
All right, yeah, so we're going to grab all of these, and then we're going to re-fertilize things. Now, I'm curious to know, since there's still evidently, like, fertilizer in the pot, if I can just slap the new fertilizer on top, or if I need to actually, like, pick them up and start over completely. I need to look at the recipe again, because I don't even know if I have the resources to make the fertilizer that I need. Let's see here. Deluxe retaining soil. Oh! My god, those are super easy to acquire resources. Heck yeah! Clay is probably the hardest thing. Um, well, I, I mean, I guess the stone sucks, because we need stone for so many things. Uh, but technically it's easy, because we can just buy it. But, uh... Yeah, stone, fiber. Let's get our... Ooh, devil clay. Um, yeah, just whip me up a... That's not nearly enough when I'm missing fiber. Uh, I gotta grow some fiber seeds, don't I? Let's see here. Was fiber seeds a recipe, or... I know fiber seeds are a thing that exists, but do I have to buy it from Pierre? Because yeah, I can't do that. Alright. Games, RPG, you play as men or girl? Um, it depends. Um, typically, I will design my character to look like myself, but in games where I have multiple profiles, then I'll switch things around. Um, so like Stardew Valley, like this is my first save, so my character looks like myself. Um, but I have another save where I have a female character. It's just typically the way I approach it. Alright. I cannot just put that there, so I do have to tear up that whole thing. I also don't have a whole lot of stones. <sighs> now that the animals are tucked away in bed. Interesting that it seems like the pigs will not put truffles on anywhere that's got like grass grass. They have to actually consume it. It's interesting. Uh, did I already get my fish pond and stuff? I did. So not a whole lot of things to, left to do for right now. Uh, let me check. Starfruit. Yeah, heck, we'll, we'll make more seeds. We'll just do it with those. The rest, we're going to slap in here. I think we'll make some fine wine. You know what, I tell you where we can find some fiber is um, in the mutant bug lair. So do I have a slime jack? I do have a slime jack, because I think that's one of the next things I want to put in a pond. Um, 
I think it's the algae that they produce is what I wanted. Oh, I forgot to put those. Oh, well. Yeah, we can get some bug meat, too. Um, but, uh, decent fishing stuff, because... So here, what does that stuff do again? Catch two fish at once. Yeah. Yep, that's, uh... Pretty good. I don't have any fishing bait in my inventory. I would lure those back up. Yeah, let's get some fiber. Oh, these are some durable bugs. Come on, hatch. There we go. here. This is uh, pretty good. Better than Raisin Bran. Algae soup! I wish I could hit those in one hit. I mean, two's not bad, but it's kind of annoying because they have such a long knockback. More algae soup. There's no fiber here, but I guess I can mine this. Get some rocks. But yeah, what about you, Adam Gems? Do you uh, typically play as uh, female or male in games? I guess not. We got some unfinished business. There we go. Alright, well I guess we can pretty much call it there. Just go ahead and get back home. Men, only life sims female. Any particular reason? Or is it just how you feel? Could sell the algae soup, but I think I'll hold on to it. Well, you know what? I don't have a thousand gold to waste. I've only got 33 gold, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and go in here and um, handle my inventory, because <laughs> why not? Let's see. 
Here, uh, sweet pea. You know, I had some kind of forageable. And then, um, we do have that geode. Got the coal there. And the fiber. Do we have enough of... Let's see, what is it? Stone, that, and clay. Now we're out of fiber and stone, essentially. Okay. Lysem is you, but yeah, why why is your like default typically male though? It, like I could see for like online games, but oh, I fell asleep right there because I know it can be pretty miserable being a female character in online games. Um, cause there are some toxic, toxic people out there. Just curious. Well, we made some money. <laughs> All that jelly is so worthless. Like I said before, though, I don't like wasting the berries. Even though it's worthless, I just feel like I gotta do something with them. Alright, well, we're gonna end there tonight. Um, I'm gonna take a drink of water real quick, though. My throat's feeling scratchy. Ah, uh, it's a lot better. All right, well, we got our buildings moved. Um, we got another pond being made. Um, got some more furnaces. We made a little bit of progress. I would have liked to have made more progress on the farm, but that's all right. Our main goal, I think, now is to just keep generating money, buy more copper from Clint. Um, oh, yeah, we also we finished that quest, and we got the Geode Crushers. That was cool. Um, but yeah, buy more copper and get more stone from Robin and just fill out that mine area with furnaces. That's kind of like my main goal with the main island. But tomorrow we will be back with more Stardew Valley. Um, and we're going to go back to Ginger Island, I think. I think with each day we're going to kind of flip-flop between wrapping things up on the main island and exploring more of Ginger Island. Um, our main island. I keep saying, I, I, there's nothing that says this is an island other than it's probably a continent, which is a big island. But anyway. Um, feels better in games like Mass Effect. Okay. I mean, yeah, I mean, I guess that's, that's totally a preference though. That's cool. Um, but yeah, so that wraps up today. Um, let me go ahead and hit this raid button so that way we can see some more Dave the Diver from Quasi. Uh, but yeah, have a great night, everyone. Thanks for coming out, watching, and uh, thank you, Adam Gems, for being here and chatting with me. And um, I will see everyone tomorrow. Have a great night, everyone.